If you want to be able to publish NPM packages to a local NPM registry so that they can be used and tested, either before publishing them to a remote one or because NPM link or even Yalk are not working for you, or if you just need a really easy to use and install private NPM registry, in this series, you will learn how. Keep watching. Hi there, I'm Manuel Gutierrez from delighthouse.co and in this quick tips series, I will share snackable videos focusing on just one feature or problem. So if you are new here, hit the subscribe and the bell notification buttons below so you don't miss a thing. Let's start. For my local NPM registry, I am going to use Verdacho. Let's first download Verdacho's image using Docker. After that, start the container using the suggested command under readme file. Open the server in the browser. You will see that it shows how to create a user and also how to publish packages into your private NPM registry. I've created two node applications. The first one is going to take the role of the library that we want to publish into our private NPM registry. And the other one is going to be taking the role of the application that requires that library. They both have really simple package.json and index.js files. If we open the terminal for the library project and we try to publish a package right now, it fails given that we haven't created any users. Add the user providing the username, password, and an email. Try publishing the package again. It should succeed now. Once you reload Verdacho's page, you will see your new package. Let's head to our node application. If you try using npm or yarn to install the package, you will have an issue. This is because we are using the default npm registry. We can check that by using npm registry. It shows that we are using registry.npmjs.org. Given that I only want this project to use my local npm registry, I will create a .npmrc file where I will specify the URL to the local registry. If we check what's the current registry for this project, we should get the one that we just configured. After that, try installing your package again. This time it works fine. You could also configure Node.js globally to use the private registry. For this, use npm set registry and specify the URL for it. Awesome, congratulations and thanks for watching. You can join the free mini course associated with this video by clicking on the link in the description below. Share any comments or suggestions about the series or future topics. And if you like the video, also hit the like button below.